part six. I'm going to try and talk over this music. <laughs> I'm going to get pinged for it again. I got pinged last episode. It reckons it's not available in some countries, but so far, all of the people who like to watch it, they've seen it, so that's good. So, welcome to part six of Life is Strange. Uh, I'm getting into this game. I'm starting to see the kind of character that Max is. I'm also trying to um, figure out... What's going on with all the other characters? You know, is Victoria really as big a bitch? The diner looks um, exactly the same. We were going to this Two Whales diner to eat this ass buster meal um, with Chloe. We're meeting her in there. We also um, want to help Kate. We want to help Kate. Um, welcome. Uh, part six. Kate has released a viral video where she accidentally got drugged, it seemed. Well... She didn't accidentally get drugged, but somebody drugged her and then she went a little... Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Hey, wire. And took a viral video of her and she was making out with people and... But now we can finally see Chloe. I threatened it all last episode. The breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware Ugh, makes me feel 13 again. Who is this dude? Let's What's up, to... Justin? Getting my coffee on before I cut class and destroy some rails. Shouldn't you be taking photos? I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You cracked me up, Maxter. Of course I'm baked. So I'll laugh at anything. You should be <laughs> studying, bad boy. So where's all your homework, schoolgirl? School? Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. Can I talk to our homeboy? Go on, hey, let's Trevor. do it. Holla, Max. By the way, I know you saw me in the dorm. Yeah, I saw you coming out of Dana's room. Uh, ooh, yeah, la -la. and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. How did Justin react? I got him blazed. He was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. See you in class, Max. Two stoners, but they seem all right. Where's Seedor? Where's Chloe? Chloe. I can speak to the police officer. I can't speak to dude. Kate Marsh, love you long time. Oh gosh. Flush before pissing on floor. Seems legit. I aim to misbehave. Rachel A owes me a BJ. So does your mum. Yo. The <laughs> What's written in here? Um, Arcadia Gay Sucks Deck is legit stuff I would see honestly in the uh, in bathrooms where I'm at legitimately yeah we're making memories up in this can we look at that flyer oh I can photo that oh, no, I can't even look at those Ew! What can we do with that one? That graffiti has been here forever. You'd never know how weird this town is by these postcards. Right? So weird. Where is she? Maybe I need to sit down at an empty booth. Who's this dude? Should we speak to him? Did you catch any big ones today? If by big you mean none, then sure. I caught a lot of big ones today. Now let me mourn over my eggs. Yo. Let's talk to the copper. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. Um. Just hungry and thinking about what to eat. Now that is a real problem at the uh, two wells. I can never decide. Joyce's pumpkin pie or grilled mac and cheese? David. 
Joyce, Chloe. Uh, I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? Just curious. Just curious. I'm surprised he's not a police officer in Arcadia Bay. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. At the station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> not everybody can be a cop. Ooh. So, you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <sighs> Poor Joyce. Just heard she even just got busted with pot in her room. Oh. Uh, who told you that? I didn't hear it on the police scanner. Joyce said the weed belonged to Chloe's friend, but I highly doubt that. Joyce didn't tell you who? She wouldn't. Afraid I'd go arrest somebody, as if I would. I just tell that loser to stay the hell away from Chloe, or else. <laughs> just kidding. Besides, David Madsen's watching over. Is she a friend of yours? I know her. Then you know she's a handful. She can be, but she can also be a good friend who shows up when you need her. Sounds like you're a good friend. I wish she would be a great daughter and not cause Joyce so much stress. How well you do you Joyce. know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our... our mother. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. Wise policy. The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up my coffee and get to work. Thanks for talking, officer. I'm probably not going to talk to all of them, otherwise I'll be here all oh, fucking day. Where, where am I going to sit down? Alright, now we wait for the blue-headed beast. Joyce is cooking up a storm. Max Caulfield, is that you, honey? And there she is. A lovely young woman. I wasn't How are that you far doing, off? Max? Hi, Joyce. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But I wish you'd been here call to help Joyce. save Chloe. She call her. She got busted yesterday smoking out. This is Price. Again. I know. Chloe told me that her stepfather hit her. I am sorry that was your introduction to David. I hope you get to know him on your terms, not Chloe's. He's a good man, he just... Yeah, I'm sure he is since you married him, but... Don't be so harsh on Chloe. True it's that. good you're here. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. Karma. You moved forward with your life. I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more really of you. Chloe needs an old friend hand again. gestures. Joyce, I am so I'm, sorry oh, about William. Like, I have great I'm memories to move of on. I'm glad, Max. With William. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Nobody talks on these. Chloe understands. She just Does. needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I see why. Add it to the list. Why? What did Chloe tell you? David hit her. Well, Chloe texted me that David slapped her yesterday. He feels awful. And he will be punished. Yeah. But Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. 
He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. Oh. I don't know which one to ask. That's no excuse to hit a girl. He's an adult. I don't like it either, Max. David swore it would never happen again. Well, we'll see. He's true to his word. I seen that I on just Jerry want Springer. Us to be a family soon. I guess. I guess it's all about time. I think you're right, Joyce. So, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? Oh, Belgian waffle, bacon omelette. Oh, we'll go waffles. You ever played a game so much that you don't blink? Your eyes burn? The last good Belgian waffle I had was here when I was 13 years old. So, bring it on. Now finish your coffee. Where are you getting your money from, girl? It's nice to see everyone has shoes on. That's my thing. One Belgian waffle for the hungry girl, pronto. For the hungry girl, she said for my friend Max. I love the delicious anticipation of breakfast. Go away, Trevor. Oh no, you're fisherman. Finish my coffee. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Where did ass pasta is? Am I too concerned with that? Lies, there is nothing. They let me down. Last episode I was here just See I can look at the coffee. I can drink it apparently. Can I get some beer and bacon before? This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. <laughs> it looks like you had plenty. Stick with the bacon. This country song will probably get me scunted as well. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. Go away. What else what can I do? This is my waffles. I can hear your stomach rumbling from yeah. here, Max. Here, you'll love this. I'm drooling like a baby. Oh, that? Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, ah. Oh. You're a little bit. You're in my personal mm. space Speak here. Speak to the devil. Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. No, you're not. This is my treat to you for coming back to rescue my daughter. Nobody needs to rescue me. Unless you set your room on fire smoking out. Oh, God, here it comes. Didn't you and Sergeant Pepper already read me the riot act last night? Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. Oh, I'm surprised she's not a you vegan. Guys are just still the same. TBH. Another reason to blow this town. What is this just shit on the jukebox? Let's blow this hush puppy. Now that that's out of the way, let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation, mm. and I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. This is all happening so fast. We'll start slow. Right here, now. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. Hmm. I don't know. Do you have some kind of power or not? Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna rewind it. And the guy stick that up, yeah. That Cigarettes, was beyond keys. epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. Coins. You need what to I look at the look. items and rewind so Chloe believes you. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. K. 
keys, cigarettes, coins. This is a warning ticket. Out of the parking bay. Okay, I can remember those. I can remember those. Ooh, yeah! You got this, Max. Now rewind and blow Chloe's mind. Yeah, blow her mind. So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Cigarettes. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Oh shit, a brick! Really? Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pocket? I just guessed that. Oh, I didn't count the fucking money. Oh, sorry. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Shit. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. You do have that Irish luck, Caulfield. What else? Mm. Money. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? I don't know. Do you have some kind of power or not? Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Okay, I gotta go back and count. Seven cigarettes. I didn't know how to count the shit. That was Fuck. beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. Do it again. It's fine. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully One, and don't two, forget three, four, anything. Four, five, six. There was seven and I just fucking guessed that. Oh, quarter. What are those other ones? One cents. What's that other one up there? Five cents. Okay, so I've got to do this. It's... 25, 25, 20. why y'all got to make me math in this bitch? 75 cents, okay, plus another 5 cents is 80. So then there's 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 86 cents, you rich bitch. I'm not going to remember any of this, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Out of the parking bay, Twin Peaks, 10.34. What was it? 86 cents. No, it wasn't. <laughs> 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85. It was 86 cents. 86 cents, 10.34, out of parking bay. 86 cents. Out of parking bay, 10.34. Rewind it faster, man. Here we go. So this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Yeah, okay, it is. I'm hella ready. Cigarettes. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Seven. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pockets? Before I forget them, let's do the money. <laughs> Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? 86, 86 cents. That's right. Living large in Arcadia Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. A parking, parking ticket. ticket. You know me well. But what is the exact time I was busted? 10.34. 10.34 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time. Even a broken clock is right twice a day. Whatever the hell that means. Your car keys. Duh! Way too easy. I need details. Describe Smashed my keychain. It. Panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. Amaze balls. I literally just got chills all over my neck. You have powers. I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Better well, her plate's enough. bigger than mine. Very good save. She can get all that bacon Man, and I'm eggs and like sausages. Clearly. And I get this little tiny waffle. I'm freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. 
You should believe me anyway, you bitch. I will predict the future. No way. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Okay, she waved. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No oh, refill for you. Breaks a cup. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That's the best song I've this heard is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So yeah. what are you waiting for? Now pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. Okay. No. Trevor, no. Tucker drops a mug. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? Um, alert on a cop's radio. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and he quickly exits the diner. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Um, uh, Justin and Trevor f fight, and Joyce beats them, and Joyce doesn't care, and Joyce stops them. Justin and Trevor are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. Uh, as a butterfly lands in it. Oh, I didn't fucking see. So the trucker didn't get up though. Not that I saw. Maybe he did. I don't remember. I didn't see a butterfly landing on the shit or a fly. The jukebox goes crazy as the trucker tries to play a new song. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. Nope. It's a fucking cockroach. Hey, bitch. Oops. Dude, Did you, you right. break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a I think dick. not, Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. Nah. I'm gonna try it. Oh, no. You know what? Let it go and then I'll rewind it. There's a cockroach. There's a cockroach. Try it again. Try it again. I'm going to predict. Uh, trucker drops his mug. The trucker drops his mug. We and know that one. Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? The cop gets alert and he leaves and he answers. He eats a donut and his partner leaves. The cop That's gets an emergency alert on his radio and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Um, and Joyce stops Justin them. Justin and Trevor are fighting and, and it's Joyce a cockroach. breaks up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. The jukebox no. goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything let's happens. Let's see. Like I said. think I got it this time, people. I think I got it. Oops. Did you break another cup? Oh, what really? Go, Mom? No refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You called it. He's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. 
I'm finishing it. Trevor and Justin must be in love. You predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This isn't a toy, Chloe. I do have to be careful how I use it. Screw that! That's wrong. Of course it's a toy. The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened! Grow up. Maybe you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We but have like to play. 45 I don't seconds. Have time. You did not just say that. Uh, check out your nose. Too much blow? Hey, are you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. A you need secret a sidekick to volcano you. Okay, lair. Go. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. Did you even pay? Oh no. Give some money there. What's wrong with y'all? We're gonna go up and pay. I think I'm ready for thirds. But you only oh, on your first. Three. My stomach plans ahead. Your stomach is stocking up for winter. What am I supposed to do? I'd love to lecture you over coffee, but I prefer to drink in silence and solitude. I'm not even sure what I'm supposed to do. Ooh. Speak, there was speak there. Hey. Okay, Supergirl, let's go to my secret place. Don't even answer. We have places to go and people to do. Who is it? Come on, before mom starts some more shit, let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So go ahead, chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with too. It's Kate. I've got to help Kate. Come on. Why are you going to throw this on me now? Hey, Kate. What's up? Please, don't let your best friend get in the way. You okay? I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate, please, go ahead. You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now, let's rock. Sucks that Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. It does. But who the f is that? Creeper. And that's where we're going to end the episode today. I hope you enjoyed it. We're at this secret hideout. Looks like it's got an old Ford Falcon there. Oh, no, that could be a little Ford laser. Not sure. I'm sure, these are Is all the Aussie race? cars. Keep up. How many times are you going to get pissed at me this week? That depends on you and how well you do in this phase of the test. Welcome now, you're to listening. American Rust. My home away from hell. To all of this, but you'll hear it in the next Raw episode. Raw and well. rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back, and she's also super-sized? We don't know for how long. Exactly why it's time to have fun. Yes. Let's just stand here. David might be a Ooh. douche, but you did steal his gun. Is everybody armed in Arcadia Bay now? Only the ones who shouldn't be. Like Step Dildo. Until now. I'm not in the revolution yet, Che. You are the revolution, Max. So we should figure out how to best use and abuse your power with a test. Drink. Don't shoot yourself. Yuck. You are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. Yuck. Yuck. Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Beer and guns? <laughs> nice combo. You can handle it. Now go find Ooh. us five bottles, pretty please. Ah, great. Now we can actually end the episode. We're not going to go looking around for five bottles yet. We're going to save that riveting piece of gameplay for the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this. I actually did. I got to do a few puzzles. I got, you got to see me struggle at maths big time, um, which I'm sure you're going to find very funny. 
thank you so much for watching this series. Um, this is part six of Life is Strange, and I am enjoying it so far, I have to admit. I'm, I'm just getting a feel of the game a little bit more. I think the storyline is going to explode soon and shit is going to happen and I'm probably not going to be overly happy with it and judging by my decision making skills none of you watching are going to be overly happy with it either thank you so much uh, please subscribe to this YouTube channel if you did enjoy it I've got a load of other videos as well I've done um, games like Man of Medan games like Little Hope Tell Me Why I did the entire Detroit series as well um, Blair Witch, go and Break watch time. those if you do uh, enjoy, you know, the silly way that I do these videos. Um, I'll be back next week with another two episodes. I'm also on Twitch. Uh, feel free to follow me, twitch.tv forward slash the no good game, and also on Instagram at the no good game as well. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one.